What up, YouTube world? Here's a second part of the mail uh, recap over the past couple weeks. Uh, some DVDs in. Uh, some wrestling VHS. Start off with the DVDs. Uh, Jersey All Pro Wrestling. Best of Volume 1. Uh, PWG Pro Wrestling Gorilla After School Special from what is this? October 1st, 05. Chris Hero right there in the middle. Chikara, King of the Trios, uh, from 3108. Old WCW fans, give you a second here, looking at him. Think who that is. A guy that was hyped up 97 ish, 98. <laughs> hyped up to the moon. Night two, so I need to get one and three. Look down at the bottom. Glacier. Dragon Gate presents. Larry Sweeney there, top right, RIP. Rangy's a bit here. Uh, Jersey All Pro, final countdown. 14th anniversary show from 2012. Uh, Ring of Honor live in Tokyo on July 16, 2007. Uh. Ring of Honor Injustice from April 12, 2008. And then I got these from the same seller, the next one as well. Best of Samoa Joe. So that means I got one, two, and three, the originals. <clears throat> and I know I've got it, but I cannot find it for the life of me, so I had to get it again. Let's go. Paul London. I don't know why it's not focusing. Try that. There we go.
And this one's autoed by Paul London. Two disc. Trying to get as much stuff of his as I can. Uh, for This was all from one seller. This whole grouping you'll see now. Final Battle 09 with... What is this? Eye of the Storm 2 on there. Uh, final Countdown Tour in Dayton. Final Countdown Tour Boston. Final Countdown Tour Chicago. And in Glory by Honor, I want to say seven or eight. This is his final match in the Ring of Honor, Daniel or Brian Danielson. Chaos at the Cow Palace, October 21st, 07. Gold Rush. 319-2010. That's a match I'm very looking forward to. Petey Williams and uh, Austin Aries. Clash of the Contenders. October 9th, 2009. Reverse the Curse, December 5th, Bloodlust, uh, ROH's bloodiest matches, let's go Spanky and Briscoe, Natural Board and Sinners versus Carnage Crew, Carnage Crew versus The Hit Squad, Xavier Briscoe, Abdul and Homicide versus Carnage Crew, Dusty Rhodes, Homicide and Friends versus CW, Victory, David Young, and the Brawl Room Brawlers. Carnage Crew versus Hot Stuff Hernandez, Fast Eddie, and Don Juan. <laughs> Come on. Punk and Combatant versus Whitmer and uh, Raven. Punk and Raven. Conclusion uh, the Punk Raven cage match. That's a great match. And then Carnage Crew versus Special K. That one's another real tough one to run across. Uh, Honor takes center stage, night one. Unscripted three. Aries Black should be a good match. Reckless Abandon.
Good times, great memories. Cabana's quote unquote last show, which it wasn't, but. Manhattan Mayhem 4, March 19th, 2011. Another solid card there. The Homecoming 2. Jerry Lynn champ at the time. And Final Battle 2010. The Stardy Boy on the cover. That's El Generico. He's going to fight El Generico. So there's the Ring of Honor stack in Indies. And here's what came today that I'm excited about and everybody else just sort of seems to be in a eh, 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 whatever. But I can understand. I have to see what these first ones are. Sent seller out of these our video presents tape number and he's got he got numbers here. What that means to me? Nothing. I don't know. I have no idea what that even I'll have to go check the catalog. Uh -oh. to see uh To see what they, you know, whatever's on the show, because it just has, has a generic, not even with the label there. So, put those to the side, because again. This stuff I've never again seen before. I can only see it so many times before people actually get the full grasp of everything. Not that everybody or anybody will listen to this, but <clears throat> okay. Starting off. BHS. I don't know if that's all Japan, New Japan. Northeast Wrestling. So I need part one, two, and four. Now we get to the fun stuff, the FMW, Frontier Martial Arts uh, Wrestling. For my birthday, 1993, when I
Terry Funka. I don't know if that's against Dory there. It looks like Dory. Onita. 117 minutes. Got this little seal down here too. Onita. Nine nineteen ninety two. Barbed wire here. The with the explosive type deals on the side of the ring. Onita again. Tiger Jeet Singh. I know that guy. The second one down in the yellow deal there. I know him. I can't think of his name. Some checks down there at the bottom. The gold seal here. These he threw in for free. So I was, he said he had a couple extras. So I didn't know if he'd send them or not. He did. Stuck, stuck with it. I'm super glad. I'm glad I bought a bunch more from him. Wish I would have gotten them all. There's one I missed. Seal there. and all this stuff will all be interesting to watch just because you do not see it again come up that often. I know Nita, Volume 1 and 2. Watching Kamala shoot interview right now online. You can see here all is like the best of Onita, all the explosion barbed wire type matches. Which I know a lot of people garbage wrestling. It's something different. It's just something different and again something I've always followed, so I'm always gonna be interested in it. This comes out like this. So an odd packaging but Japanese, so once again you see all the Hopefully it's not focusing at all. But there's those, and two more. We made it this long, congrats. FMW 82894, day before my brother's. That'd be 11th birthday? I think that's Madman Pondo. Or Mr. Pogo. Right there. Right there, uh, Mike Awesome Gladiator. I don't know who that is though. I'm sure if I heard the name, I'd automatically he didn't recognize it. But the exploding ring around a pool mat or in, inside of a pool. I don't know one that I wanted the most because he's on the cover and people know my affinity for him. But FMW, this is a nice cover. This is probably the best cover. Mike Awesome, Gladiator, over in FMW, from, uh, December 11th, 96, with, uh, I think that's Hayabusa, I'm not sure. Give you a quick look at the inside here. So there it is. That is what I was excited for. <sighs> Gonna have to flip in the the VCR to make it um, you know, unplug the DVD player, switch on shit tomorrow, watch this stuff and veg. But uh should have more stuff coming in, probably won't make another video another couple weeks. 
some of you know, I'm out for nationals. Uh, for all the stuff I've been buying, Teresa hasn't gotten much. She's got a couple things she's wanted, but I, as much as I want to meet up with everyone, as much as I want to drop more money on cards that I don't need and pick up shit for you guys, uh, I'd rather use most of that money. She still needs her immigration shit. She is a citizen, she's got a green card, but she's not a full-fledged, I went in front of the judge and did the oath, citizen. So I'm gonna give her the money that I had saved, or a good chunk of it that I had saved for uh, nationals to do that. Again, not that anybody cares, but <clears throat> I'd rather do that, get that out of the way, than we have it's zero problems there, and down the road. Because that's one thing I truly believe in is get your that shit together. So I don't know, maybe next year in Cleveland, I don't know. With the card world right now, I'm just not feeling it. I just don't care. I pick stuff up and sort of like ah, going through the motions. If I could find all this type of stuff online everywhere I'd be buying it. I'm not even buying cards, so um Hope everyone's doing well out there. Take her easy YouTube, you know it. She's easy. Yes, Mike's awesome. R.I.P. Take her twice. <laughs>